The presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, Atiku Abubakar, has promised to tackle the incessant bandit attacks in southern Kaduna and other parts of the country. Atiku made the promise during a visit to southern Kaduna where he met with religious leaders and other stakeholders led by the founder of Throne Room Ministries in Kafachan, Apostle Emmanuel Kure. He was accompanied by his running mate, Governor Ifanyo Kowa, the Director General of the PDP Presidential Campaign Council, and Governor of Sokoto State, Aminu Tambuwa, among other party chieftains. Basically two. One, uh, I've come to celebrate, you know, with Apostle Kure on his 60th birthday. And then secondly, to commiserate with the people of Southern Kaduna over the recent, uh, you know, disturbances here. I understand uh, a number of lives were lost. Insecurity challenges is not only a Southern Kaduna phenomenon. It's all over the country. They should expect um, uh, a restructuring of the police, a creation of, uh, you know, a local police, either state or local uh, police, uh, to supplement uh, the Nigerian police force. It is not yet Uhuru. Nigeria is still in the woods. Let's hold hands together, all watchmen, and make sure that Nigeria fulfills her destiny, especially in this election, that the destiny of Nigeria is not aborted. That is my message to the nation. Let's not lose hope. Let's keep hope. For God is going to still show himself in these elections for the future of Nigeria. 2023 is a major year of blessing. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.